an Empire Boxing and Unlearning Network production. What's up, boxing fans? Empire is on the road, and we are in Chinatown, right outside of the brand new DCS location. Today, Lev Jackson and Red Gibbons are going to be training here today. So we're going to go say hello, and I think, I think I see JY Kim. Let's go. Oh, JY. Hey, Jason. <laughs> Yo, this is JY Kim. This is coach of Lev Jackson, and we are inside the brand new and beautiful DCS location. It's our first time here. How do you like being here? Uh, shout out Ryan Diaz. He's the man. That's all I gotta say. <laughs> Ryan Diaz, how are you doing? Good. How are you? Good. How's training today? Fantastic. Looks like you already got a good sweat on. Yeah, always good sweat every day. We're working really hard. So, what have you started with so far today? Uh, so far, he's doing a light warm. We're gonna be doing pads. I don't know. Mike, do some rounds. Do some good sparring yesterday. Okay, cool. But... Coach, we're gonna say hi to you today. How are you doing, Manny? Good, how are you? Good, nice to see you again. This is Coach Manny Sabral working with Rhett Gibbons. And uh, so we're gonna follow these guys around today, see what they're doing. What's first for Rhett today? Just warm up and then he's gonna spar with Okay, sweet. <laughs> Rhett Gibbons <laughs> in CCS. I have to say the press conference between you guys was, was a legendary. And like you're so good in that, in that like quick-witted, like, you know, banter scenario. It was like, that was awesome. Was that fun for you? Oh yeah, it was of course I had a bit of fun. It was honestly funny as I was telling my partners, like, yeah, you know, feeling a little tired, I'm just gonna be polite, get in and out, and then she comes out, she's like, Yeah, that, that wasn't exactly Classic. polite. No, like, yeah, well. I mean, I don't want to be do the schoolyard brawl thing, but he started it, so I mean. I can't help myself though either. I gotta open that. I gotta open that hatch yeah, right away. You know how to steer it up pretty well. It's like you know how to ask me the right questions, and I mean, tell me am I wrong? Did I do anything but tell the truth there? So I, I'm I'm Switzerland right now. I'm Switzerland right now. But that was yeah, a good no, time. Just, just yeah, check the scoreboard. <laughs> that, that, that's all. I remember the first time I sparred him too, he was still pretty green and he like put the work on me. I was like not expecting it at all because uh, JY said he was green. He's super talented. He's good work for Rhett. Uh, fast. He's got a good IQ too. Um, great rounds. But I have a feeling it's going to get pretty competitive here in a second. Rhett's going to start turning up. So when you're working with like a, a young guy like that, he's only got like two years of experience. I, I think he's a phenomenal boxer. Yeah, yeah. What kind of stuff are you trying to work on? Honestly, um, I try to work on like countering, jabbing. Um, I'm, I'm working on setting the pace. I don't want him to control it too much, but um, uh, obviously you're not trying to knock someone out who's, who's uh, just trying to get some work with you. And um, especially if you see you hurt someone or something, like you shouldn't put the pressure on them. You know what I mean? Um, and he's a good guy, so uh, yeah, I have respect for him. I'm happy we got to work today. Yeah, it seemed like you were you were very patient, and you definitely controlled like the tempo, uh, and it, it was like to the T, like in the minute on the clock. When you wanted to turn it up, you turned it up. When you wanted to turn it down, you turned it on. And that's something you're consciously thinking about. Yeah, absolutely. You know, um, basically working on controlling the tempo, defense, jabs, and setting up some clean shots. Yeah. Uh, some of the head movement too is real slick, like real slick. That turn, that turn away. That's <laughs> yeah. How was uh, how was Lev's work today? I don't know. It depends on who's listening. If Elroy's listening, it went terrible. <laughs> okay, so Elroy is listening. He is fucking out of shape and he doesn't look good at all. But to our own team, everybody knows that Lev is hitting harder than he usually is. So, what did last like, in the next 20 days out look like for you and Lev in terms of training and work? Uh, yeah, that's a good question. I mean. Of course it is. I asked. I think it. we're just gonna drink a lot and we're just gonna do fuck all. We're not doing anything productive, and we're just gonna dick around for the next 20 days, and we're gonna go in there and fight. Over. Yo, Lev, what's it like working with this guy here? Oh, it's fantastic. It's super fun. <laughs> As you can see, he lets me do what I want. He doesn't leave me accountable for anything. So. Yeah, <laughs> Uh, that was another episode of Empire on the Road with the champ Rhett Gibbons. Rhett, you're 20 days out. How's that sinking in? I wish it was tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, so Rhett's ready. Thank you so much for having us and kind of getting in, in the way of your training a little bit today. And uh, seeing you work was awesome. So we really appreciate the privilege to do that with you. Thanks for coming by. Okay, peace. Peace out. <laughs> Let's go. I'm Don Andrews, the Golden Voice, signing off. And we'll see you at the Takeover 2, the Uprising, March 25th.